Concerns have been raised by parents whose children will have to return to school for examinations, citing the health risks involved during the times of COVID-19. While the NGSA, CSEC, and CAPE were postponed to later dates, the Education Ministry has now employed new protocols for students to see the examinations in a classroom setting. For NGSA particularly, which is now set for July 1st and 2nd, calls have been made for the dates to be postponed, but the Education Ministry is not budging. Instead, they are allowing students to opt out of the exams. But if they do, they will not be afforded the opportunity to go to a secondary school of their choice. If the parents opt not to have their children or child write this examination, there is nothing we can do to force them, first of all. However, in not doing so, they will be placed at the school closest to them. Now, if they are not satisfied or perhaps they are saying that they have any other questions about being placed at the school closest to them. There is what we call the placement examination and that is um, done during the July month. The Education Ministry is assuring that all safety protocols will be implemented to ensure both students and educators are safe during this time. Sanitization will be done on a regular basis, and this is, of course, a work in progress. Hand washing facilities will be established at schools across the country. Furniture will be placed six feet apart based on three of public health guidelines. Every person entering the school compound must wear a mask and will be subject to the body temperature test using the non-contact inferred thermometer. Ever, a sanitization kit will be used, will be issued, sorry, to each learner. A gazetted document provides all the necessary information needed for parents and students. Those who will be writing upcoming exams are expected to return to school from June 15th. Rupa Sinarain, The Evening News.